Hey everybody, how's it going? It's the Cubaholic. Today I'm going to show you how to style your hair like Elvis from the 1950s, two different quick ways. So the first one, all we need is a comb and some sort of holding product. I use Label M Men's Thickening Tonic. It's really great, it's pretty cheap from Amazon. So what I do first, let's get right into it. I take a spray or two, put it in my hand. All right, put it on my hands together and then I just put it through my hair. Uh, the length of my hair, by the way, goes down a little bit past my nose, uh, but for this, for purposes of this haircut, you only need it down to your like eyebrows. The back's a little bit longer than Elvis had it, but I'm growing mine out, so that's how it is. This is quite a versatile haircut. So what you do is you take your comb and you slick back the hair. I like to use the wide portion of the comb, the wide tooth. Um, and you also don't have to use a comb. You can also use like a round brush. That works quite well. So it's already taken a little bit of shape, just slicked back. And uh, my hair kind of wants to part right here, which is um, pretty good. And you can do it on the other side too. Uh, it just depends on how your hair falls. I'm gonna use this side though. So slick it back. All right. Now we are going to do the swirl motion. The swirl motion, you start your comb, I'm gonna use the fine tooth portion. You start it at the opposite side of where your part will be. So for me, that's over here. You stick it in and then you swirl like that. So you go towards the part and then back away from the part. So you can kind of see that just one doing of that, it went like that, right? So you keep doing that and then the hair behind you can just kind of wrap and then slick the side back so it's already looking pretty elvis yeah i mean how long does that take it takes like 15 seconds for and then you got your hair done and for purpose or for this one yeah and you can you know play with it and toy however you want um yeah, and then also for like a more rugged modern look, I would recommend using one of these and you can get a similar effect, but I think it looks a bit more modern. Yeah, uh, this, you're not gonna get all day hold, probably because um, you only just used a little bit of this. If you, so for this one, you're gonna have to keep redoing it, but if you want that vibe where you got your comb in your back pocket, it looks pretty cool. So uh, you can also put this, Vaseline hair tonic in it to make it a bit more shiny like how Elvis had it He I think he used like what rose oil or something So I would recommend a hair tonic, but I don't do that because I don't like very greasy hair Okay for our next one. We're gonna need a blow dryer as well Otherwise the only other things we need is the hair tonic that we talked about the thickening tonic and a round brush or a vent brush Okay for the second one Let's assume that our hair, we just got out of the shower. So I'm gonna mess this up, right? There we go. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the same, like two sprays of this into our hand and then rub it in. I just did mine, so let's pretend I do two sprays, right? Get it all in there. So I'm gonna take a vent brush or you can use the round brush. Uh, both I think are fine. Um, they, they do effectively the same thing. So. I'm going to start by slicking my hair back with it. Yep. Cool. Now I'm going to take the, turn the blow dryer on. I'm going to do warm. So the medium heat on a low setting. And you just follow the comb, the brush. You can see it's already starting to look like a pompadour. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go like this to the very front and that's gonna help me get more volume. And last, and I didn't do it for very long. And then lastly, I'm gonna do that same swirl motion like this, but just with the comb or the brush and I'm gonna use the, the dryer. Yep, great. And then lastly, you can just make adjustments with your brush. 
and for the back you could do whatever you want mine's kind of long so um but you could ducktail it and it'll look awesome so i think this one has more hold because of the blow dryer but if you want you can put a finishing product on it like um i like the the men's crew pomade and that works really well that'll that'll get you hold all day so i hope that helps uh that's just two quick and easy ways to do the elvis pomp I have a much longer tutorial for like the full blown real deal. Um, you can check that out. But this is what I just do on a daily basis because it looks cool and it's really easy. All right. Take care, guys. See ya.